Welcome to the MITD Winter Cottage. There are so many different technologies in Osceola that either help teachers save time or help our students learn. But you don't have to take our word for it. Hello, my name is Kathleen Shanks and I work at Horizon Middle School. Today I will be showing you guys how I use a Microsoft Translator in my class, especially the subtitle feature um, on, in PowerPoint. And one way why I use it is because it helps my students, my ELL students who do not speak English, to be able to follow along with me what I'm saying, with what I'm saying, or whatever direction or explanation that I am giving to them orally in my class. Okay, I use it. You have to be in the slideshow area, and if you just go to the ribbon up here in the right corner, it says subtitle settings. And that way right here in the subtitle settings, right now I have it in Spanish, but you can choose whatever language you need for your students. You can, it could be Russian, it could be Portuguese, it could be Haitian Creole. They have it all here to help you accommodate your students. And once you have chosen your language, it's you can then go into slideshow. So, um, as I start speaking, the subtitle is going to appear at the top of my screen right here. However, you can still choose to switch where it appears. You can come on the bottom of your slide or the top of your slide. So that way your students are able to follow your instruction, your explanation as you're speaking um, to them and they can follow along with you without being completely lost in your classroom.